My name is Dan Hofer and I'm employed as a small business owner in Fort Wayne, Indiana. Um, I purchased my own health insurance. It's uh, very expensive, but I can't afford not to purchase it. I guess in that regard, I'm somewhat fortunate in that at least I can purchase health insurance. My health insurance right now between the deductible and the premiums costs me about $20,000 a year. It is the single largest expense that I have in my life uh, and, and I can't afford not to have it. Once again, I'm fortunate a lot of people are prevented from starting a business because of the high cost of health care. Um, the Obama Health Care Reform Act affected me dramatically in a personal way last summer. Uh, while on a family vacation, my daughter uh, was involved in an unfortunate accident that did significant damage to her leg. Uh, it required uh, a trip to the emergency room uh, while we were on vacation. It required uh, several surgeries. It required uh, an extended stay in the burn unit of the hospital. Um, she was required uh, to be in, in basically in, in quarantine to, to manage the infection. Uh, a long story short, the, the total bill for this uh, accident was in excess of $120,000 and, and still climbing. Um, um, she's, she's still uh, a ways from being completely healed. However, where, where Obamacare, um, as it's uh, popularly or unpopularly called, um, was really the saving grace for us in this context. Had that legislation not went into effect, Audrey would not have had health insurance. Um, since she's under 26 years old and uh, she's done with college, I was able to continue her health coverage on my plan. As a result, this unfortunate accident was covered by my health insurance. Uh, in the absence of the health care reform, it would not and my young daughter starting her life would be burdened with a debt uh, in excess of $120,000. If you put that aside, my real concern was that when she needed very expensive care, if she had not had that health insurance, would the required care that was needed at the level that was required, would that have been offered to her? We've all heard stories where, uh, in the absence of health insurance, uh, a certain level of, of critical quality care was not made available because the care was not funded. At any rate, for what it's worth in this man's opinion, and in my family's opinion, um, we fully support the health care reforms that have went into place. Um, we fully support the call for uh, resolving our national health care crisis, which is lack of affordable insurance to all. Personally, I'm, I'm grateful to the reforms. It has made a dramatic impact on our lives, being that in the absence of this health care reform, we would be living with $120,000 debt that we would not be able to pay. So. At any rate, uh, my thanks to the Obama administration and you have my full support on uh, moving forward with a, a national health care plan. I feel it's very, very much needed. Thank you. Have a great day.